Hello, we are Team One. This is our Module Three final video project. In this article, um, we are analyzing the effects on the supply and demand curves of egg production to um, higher organic standards for the eggs. So today we're going to be looking at some demand shifters and supply shifters how they result in a new equi equilibrium price for organic eggs. So our first supply shifter is a change in the price of production and that will occur because um, with higher standards for the organic certification, farmers will have to spend 8 to 30 million more dollars over the next 15 years to meet the standards and that will affect our supply and demand curve. Alright, so we have our supply one and demand one right here. So this first supply shifter being that the, there's an increase in the price of production. That's going to mean that there's going to be less suppliers for organic eggs. So that's going to uh, result in a shift along the supply curve up and to the left up and to the left, resulting in a supply two. Our next supply shifter is a change in seller expectations, and that is um, because the suppliers believe that consumers are willing to spend an additional 21 to 50 cents on a carton of organic eggs over non-organic. So this is going to do is shift our supply curve back down to the right, back where we started. So we're going to change these arrows here, back down where we started, and so this would be our supply three. And then our last supply shifter was a decrease in the number of suppliers. And this is because with rising organic standards, um, smaller producers will be able to afford to change to that. And um, they'll just drop out of the organic egg industry and maybe into the non-organic eggs. All right, so what this is gonna do is gonna be an increase in supply. So we're gonna go again up and to the left. So again, up and to the left. And this is going to look like our second supply, but it's actually going to be our fourth. So we're going to end up with S4. Alright. So now we can erase this, this supply right here. Because we know after our three shifters, and this is where we ended up. So now let's take a look at the demand shifters. Our first demand shifter is a change in consumer tastes and preferences. Um, the consumers lately want more humanely raised eggs and chickens, um, which obviously will cost more and they will pay more for it. So this is going to be, so this change in taste and preferences is a change up into the right on the demand curve because people's preferences are changing towards them liking these organic eggs more than non-organic eggs. So this is going to shift our demand curve up and to the right. So we have our second demand, E2, right here. And then our next demand shifter is an increase in the prices of related goods. And that is because since um, the organic standards will apply to all suppliers. Um, they will all have to increase their spending to meet them, so all the prices market-wide for organic eggs will rise. So this rise of prices is going to decrease the demand since people are going to be less willing to buy it because the prices are going up. So this is going to shift our demand back down to where it was, resulting in, or not D1, but now demand 3.
3, face off these shifters. I'm going to take away this second demand line right here. So this is going to be our final supply and demand. So we have our fourth supply, third demand, resulting in a new equ equilibrium price and quantity. So this point right here is our equilibrium after all these shifters. So thank you for watching, and I hope that we've all learned something about the organic game industry.